Hi guys, let's go ahead and do my favorite thing. We are gonna work on some of our challenges. I absolutely love doing savings challenges. They're kind of, they just motivate me and I love them so much. So this was rollover from our wallet. Um, let's go ahead and give this a count. We have 20, 30, 5, 40, I'm sorry. 20, 35, 45, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, $64 remaining from our wallet that was left over. Um, we are going to do one more thing differently. Since vacation is coming up, we are no longer going to be saving for the gift cards. So I'm going to go ahead and pull the money from our $1 challenge since I don't have enough ones to do another gift card purchase. I'm going to add this. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve dollars. We're going to add to the 64 to make 76 that we're going to do for our challenges. Um, cause I purchased a couple things off of Etsy and one of them is this uniform this unicorn game and you could see that they're in denominations of twos and ones and threes so I wanted to be able to have ones in order to do this game so we'll go ahead and get started let's let's actually start with that let's do a couple rolls for this unicorn game and this was purchased off of Etsy, it was on sale and I just thought it was so cute. My daughter absolutely loves unicorns. What girl doesn't? Um, so we're gonna go ahead and roll the dice. Whatever we land on is the amount that we're going to save. And then if we land on one of these pictures, we get to pick the denomination. I think we're gonna do $6. So let's go ahead and roll. We're gonna do a couple rolls and see what we get. So I just thought it was a nice little fun way to make savings i guess fun so six um so we're gonna start here one two three four five six we already started with a picture so this will be six dollars that we're saving and let's go ahead and roll one more time six again one two three four five six five so we will be putting in eleven dollars for this challenge i'm going to put the five back and get a 10. So we have $11 here that we're gonna do for this challenge. Do I wanna go again? Yeah, I can't, I don't wanna go again. Let's do this one more time. It's too fun. Four, one, two, three, four, another picture. That's fine. Let's go ahead and do this in one since we have so many. One, two, three, four, five, six. So now in our Unicorn Magic Game. We have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 17 dollars. And that's fun. It's just, it's different. And I love it. And if I didn't mention, this was from Cash Envelope Club on Etsy. Um, and it, it was just so cute. I couldn't pass it up. So let's go ahead and go back to the beginning where we have our five dollar challenges. Um, and let's do our June challenge where we're adding in five dollars let's do we have more money than i thought let's do 20 in this so we're gonna circle four of these because they're each five dollars and i'll come back and color these in so i'm gonna add my lonely 20 here so now in our june uh, money savings challenge and this was a freebie off of hasslefreesavings.com we have 20 35 35 dollars for our june savings challenge we will also be finishing our home challenge which i am so happy about so we'll color in two of these little doors which makes ten dollars excuse me, $10, and then this challenge will be complete. So we will just be adding in the 10. 
And now in our home challenge, we should have, I think, 120. Let's give this a count. 20, 40, 60, 81, 5, 10, 15, 20. So our home challenge is officially complete. And we will add that ooh, into our envelopes ooh, with what we already have stuffed. That's exciting. Um, next is our celebrate challenge. This was a freebie from the YouTube channel, a little of it all. And we're going to do $10. Well, I made these little, um, denominations of five a piece. So we'll do two of these. And my coloring is not the best. So don't come at me. Um, let's do, all right, let's do two fives here. And now in our celebrate challenge, we have 10, 20, 35, 45, $45 in our celebrate challenge. That's pretty awesome. This next challenge was another, um, purchase I made off of Etsy. They're little Harry Potter things. And this was from Janelle Ray Budgets. I just couldn't pass it up. I'm gonna start off with Hufflepuff because I'm pretty sure if I were to ever get um, accepted into Hogwarts, that's probably where I think I would be. Um, let's see what we have here. Let's do $10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 10. And then I have nine remaining. So let's do $10 into our Harry Potter challenge. What class do you guys think you would be if you guys got into Hogwarts, if you're even fans of Harry Potter? Um, I know I am. So that was from Janelle Ray Budgets and I just thought it was the cutest thing ever. Let's see what we have remaining. Let's put five dollars into our B challenge and this was a freebie from Lisa Grateful Me. Um, we're just gonna do a five and let's go over here. Now let's go down here because I already have a dark purple up there. Let me just color that in since it's so small. And now in our B challenge we have 50, 60, 75, 85, 85 dollars. That is adding up pretty nicely and there's still a lot to go. So I'm very excited about how much that's going to accumulate to. Um, don't have anything for Christmas. So my remaining four dollars, I'm also gonna put in my Lisa Grateful Mage challenge um, in my sloth challenge. So I have one, two, three, four, four dollars that we're gonna add in and we're just gonna color our number four here. And it's not a lot, but it adds up. So now in our sloth challenge, we have 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. $39 in our sloth challenge. And unfortunately, that is all the money that I have for um, these savings challenges. I will also get paid on Friday and I will be hitting up some of our savings challenges that day. Um, I'll probably do the Christmas one and we'll also be finally giving our see you later challenge a little bit of love. So hopefully I will see you guys on Friday for that. Hope you have a good day. Bye.